for imprints. Thank you, Alona. Sure, they are thank you. So one of the cutest <laughs> yes. animals you've ever brought on. So oh, cute. Well, thank we, you. We appreciate it. And Lorelai <laughs> with the Austin Animal Center and Piper they, Imprints. Adorable. Here they are, six weeks old. So they're a very good example of what we need down at the shelter, which are fosters right now. Spring has hit us very hard. We have tons of babies. Uh, a little pair like this need three more weeks before we can adopt them out. So they need a mommy and a daddy right now, really. You know, they're going to be whiny. They're going to be uh, like chewing but it's on cute, things. Whiny. But, and, you know, it's so rewarding. So fosters, and of course, we need adopters. We now have over a thousand animals in our inventory. That's extraordinary. So to keep our community no kill, we ask for your help. Fostering is great, but adoption is better. You know, for a lifetime commitment, you know, today would be a great day to come down and look at what we have. When Definitely. you have a thousand, anything can Over, help, I'm sure. Yes, everything helps. So we do have our great big pet extravaganza I am big today. event today. Yeah. It's your first time Huge. ever doing first this. First annual, please come on down. We're going to have a behavioralist there. We're going to have agility trials. You're going to see lots of vendors with information. We're going to have a lot of partners there that can help you uh, for breed-specific ideas. Like a lot of folks like our bull breeds here in Austin so mm -hmm. we're going to have lovable there you can find out where you can actually live to have your pet you know where they're based on their behavior and not their breed so there's a lot of apartments now doing that because we want folks to have their pets you know right and of course fostering we definitely need foster and the event today I mean the whole family can come out you said there Absolutely. might be clowns, there's, gonna be for clowns. The kids. there's food vendors there's uh, cupcakes you know and coffee for the adults and yeah lots of stuff going on and of course all these great pets to look at adorable and for them would it be better if they go to the house the same home, the Absolutely. same foster family. Absolutely, for fostering, takes definitely, you want to keep the pair together. They learn from each other out there while they were waiting in their little room. They were really playing, playing tug of war with one another. It was so. Oh, so, oh, 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 they're oh, kind of growling. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Listen to that. Oh, so cute. <laughs> Clearly, Piper's they're in charge. They're adorable. Are they? Do you think you know when they're up for adoption? You think they're going to be pretty small, like teacup? Oh, very or? tiny, tiny, tiny. You're looking at four pounds, maybe. Oh, wow. Yeah, they're yeah. adorable. They're, they're about a quarter and a half right now. I love them. Well, thank you so much. You're for coming on that pet extravaganza. I'm sure it'll be a really fun event. Yes. You can check out other cats and dogs looking for a good home by logging on to our new pet section on KVU.com or visit the Austin Animal Center at 7201 Lee Vanderloop. They normally open up at 11, and today that pet extravaganza starts at 10.